charged in the murder of a new Richmond father and son was back in court today. WCPO 9 News reporter Jessica Hart is joining us. She was in the court today for that hearing. Jessica, you say that he wasn't in front of the judge, though, for very long. Craig, I'm outside the Claremont County Municipal Court where 20 year old Dakota Pfeiffer went before a judge for his preliminary hearing, but he was granted a continuance, so he was only in front of the judge today for less than three minutes. 59 year old Rusty Larison and his 34 year old son Ryan were murdered in their home in New Richmond on July 14th. The Larison's neighbor heard gunshots and called 911. There's two guys in here. I just sent my son in law over here. We heard gunshot wounds. The doors opened. They said, Rusty. One of them is laying on a couch and one's laying on the floor. Now six people are charged in the double murder. Four of them are teenagers. This is State B Dakota Pfeiffer. The oldest person charged is 20 year old Dakota Pfeiffer. He was in court today for a preliminary hearing, but was granted a continuance. Before the judge approved that continuance, he read this request from the state. On the initial charge uh, that was filed July 15th, the tampering with evidence felony, the third degree charge. The state is requesting that I dismiss that case, that I dismiss it without prejudice. They indicate they plan to present it to the grand jury this week. Police say Pfeiffer admitted he removed items believed to be belong to the Larison's murderer. Court documents show he had prior knowledge others charged were planning to rob the Larison's. Pfeiffer is currently being held at the Claremont County Jail on a $1.5 million bond. Pfeiffer is set to be back in court this Thursday at 1 p.m. for his preliminary hearing. Then on Saturday, family members of Ryan and Rusty will be holding a benefit at the Front Street Cafe to help pay for some of those funeral expenses. Live in Claremont County, Jessica Hart, WCPO 9 News.